Hey guys, I am back with another video. Today we are going to build this photography turntable with Arduino. A photography turntable built using an Arduino and a GRBL shield is a versatile tool for capturing stunning 360 degree visuals of objects. This setup leverages the Arduino microcontroller for precise control, while the GRBL shield, designed for CNC applications, simplifies the management of stepper motors and ensures smooth and accurate rotation. Typically, the turntable is equipped with a stepper motor to drive the rotation and a driver module to manage motor movements. By uploading G-code to the Arduino, the system can interpret G-code commands, allowing users to define rotation angles, speed and stopping points. By automating the rotation and integrating camera triggers if needed, this setup simplifies the process, enhances productivity and ensures high quality results, making it invaluable for photographers and creators and can be made with less components and does not need intricate programming. To make this photography turntable, we will require some 3D printed parts. You can get the STL file from the video description. And that being said, I have printed these parts on my Ender 3 S1 Pro and sliced with Cura with an infill of 50% for bigger components, especially the top and base, and a 20% infill for support structures which go along with this. This small gear is an exception. For this part, I have to change the infill to 80%. For the smooth movement of the base which is attached, we will use bearings for that. We will require four bearings for the project, which is W62032RS1 bearings, which are embedded with stainless steel deep groove balls with a bore diameter of 17 mm, outer dia of 40 mm, and width of 12 mm. Then we take the base plate, which was 3D printed, and attach bearings to all the cylindrical overhangs. There will be three on the sides, and one on the center of the base plate. After completion, it would look like this. To drive the top plate, we need a NEMA 17 stepper motor, then attaching the small gear to the NEMA 17 shaft firmly. And make sure the gear is perfectly fit to the shaft, also it is not leaning to one side. Then securing the wire to the stepper motor and attaching it to the base plate on the gross provided. Later on driving the wire through the cavity, which was provided on the plate. Then install the motor drivers to the GRBL controller. Please take a note on the alignment of the driver while installing and then fix the GRBL controller to the Arduino board. Make sure no pins on the controller get unaligned on the female headers. Here I am connecting the wire to the enable pin 8. For powering, I use a 12 volt 20 amps power supply. First I secure the positive and negative DC wire to the power supply and then the EC live wires. Be aware of the polarity since it can cause hazards. Similarly for the controller, I secure the wire on the screw terminals. It is a good practice to crimp the wires apart from using the bare copper leads. And it's time to program the Arduino. The first three lines on the code define some parameters, which are the enable X direction value and X step of motor value. Then the motor delay time, which I have mentioned as 350 milliseconds, and also the steps value as 6400. On selecting Arduino, you know as the board name, I have uploaded the code. On successful uploading, the stepper motor starts to spin, which indicates everything is perfect. And we can close the top cover to the base and complete the project. There you have it, a fully functional photography turntable powered by Arduino and brought to life with 3D printing. Perfect for capturing stunning 360 degree shots with ease. If you enjoyed this project, don't forget to like, share and subscribe.